Game two of the three game series between the Texas Longhorn and the Raging Cajuns. It was a 2-1 ball game when we go to the top of the night. Texas comes in, Bo Ridgeway comes into the game in trouble right off the bat. Couldn't feel butts and couldn't play butt defense. Bo Ridgeway, you, you feel he's the right guy out there, but the Raging Cajuns would go and play small ball just to get the runners in scoring position. And before you know it, they have bases loaded and nobody out. Then a sacrifice fly ties the ball game up. Goes the other way, almost a collision in the outfield between Todd and Ellis. Runners get the first and third. And then there was some unusual thing, interference at the plate. But right here, the squeeze gives the Raging Cajuns a 3-2 to two lead. Well, they scored two runs there in the ninth inning and got the ball in the infield one time. A closer comes in the game, Dylan Moore, and that Duke Ellis off of Moore's ankle. His great speed reaches first base, so a leadoff hitter on. Very important against a closer like Dylan Moore, and very important for the Longhorn. Excellent bunt by David Hamilton. Moves Duke Ellis in the scoring position, and that brings Hipper to the plate, who ties the game. Mason's been hot to begin this season. The first two games just doesn't do, do too much. It drives a single up the middle and ties the game. After two outs, then all of a sudden, Austin Todd comes to the plate, gets a fastball in the middle of the plate. Two-run shot, walk-off stop. Right down the middle, a nice, easy swing. Austin Todd says he's never felt it like that in his life. Longhorns take game two, five, three.